and welcome to our channel. I'm Allison. I'm Jackie. And I'm Mackenzie. Today we'll be playing Lords of Waterdeep with the Skullport expansion at Game House Cafe in Glendale, California. Lords of Waterdeep was designed by Peter Lee and Rodney Thompson and published by Wizards of the Coast. We'll each be playing a different Lord card, so we'll be optimizing our strategies based on that Lord. I am the Xanathar. This is going to be so much fun. I get to have all the corruption and all the goods right at the start. So of course I'm going to go for those 40 point quests. Bring it on. My Lord gives me six points for one type of quest. So I started with a piety quest that's really good. So I think I'm going to just go for piety quest the entire game and try to maximize the bonus for the Lord. I drew the builder. The builder scores six victory points for each building. So if I can get all nine of my buildings built, I'll score 54 victory points. Now let's play. I think I will go to, let's see, I have $4. Mm -hmm. I think I will go to Builder's Hall and purchase a building for $4. You can already grab a victory point while you're at it. And grabbing one victory point. So you're already in the lead. <laughs> building okay. already. So I'm going to build Thimblewine's Pawn Shop. So you can return corruption and gain money, but you'll also get money. Mm -hmm. Cool. I think I have a pretty good quest here that I think I'm going to try to get done as soon as possible. So okay. I'm going to go over there, which gives me two uh, here? any cube of, yes, oh. two of any kind of resource. I do get a corruption, um, but I will get two white. I'm going to take one of my little workers and send him over here and get some corruption as well as two blacks and two soldiers, which are orange. All right. I'm also going to go get some corruption and a bunch of stuff. So I'm going to take one corruption, five dollars, a quest, and I think I will take this quest. Oh, are you sure? Oh, are you sure? I'm pretty sure. Okay. And an intrigue card. Mm. All right. Well, let's see how it's going, Allison. <laughs> um, what's big? Oh, wow. Do you want that quest? Yeah. Uh, I'm going you to come over here quest. and take do. this quest. almost the exact same quest. I do. And I'm going to get an entry card. Wow, the expansion space is already gone, so mm -hmm. the locations are really good. Must be but they give you a corruption. Well, everybody's going to need a purple. There's no other way to get purple right now. So, self-included, I need that purple. Okay, I'm going to go back to Cliff Watch Inn, take a quest. Another quest? Another quest and take two dollars. All right, I think I will go there. I have, I'm going to return a corruption mm -hmm. and I will take a dollar. And I take two dollars. You take two? Yes. Mm. You get a dollar, but I get two dollars. Right. But I get to return a corruption. Yes. Which is a negative point at the yes. end of the game. Let's see. I am going to end up taking two more orange. Space it out. Okay. None of us has completed a quest. Mm -mm. None of us completed a quest, and nobody went to Waterdeep Harbor. So that's the end of round one. All right. All right, first player. I think I'm going to go to Builder's Hall. I'm going to build Shraden's Excellent Zombies. Perfect. Sounds like a great building to build. That's a whole bunch of stuff, too. I'll spend That's a lot six. of corruption coming out, though, too. <laughs> There's a lot of corruption coming out with only one place to return it. All right. I'll take two victory points. I'm going to come over here and take this quest. It is a piety quest. And I get an entry card, thank you. Mm -hmm. I'm definitely gonna do this. I'm definitely gonna do it. Skull Island, get that one corruption for me. And I am going to take two colors of my choosing. I'm going to take one purple and one white. And. Uh oh, bum bum bum. I'm gonna complete a quest. Oh. Here she goes. And first quest. Here my she first goes. quest is gonna cost two wizards, one cleric, three soldiers, and that's it. I get what? 16 points. Wow. Plus I get another corruption, so that's not so great for me. And once on your turn, whenever you draw any corruption, draw an intrigue card. My question is, 
Do I also get an entry card for this current corruption of no, this guy? No, no. Darn. <laughs> All right. From now on. From now on. Okay, from now on. But 16 points for the Thank right. you. Wow. She's Jumping winning. Ahead. She's Jumping winning. Ahead. Just okay, barely, I think barely. I will go to my own building. I will take a corruption. Three fighters or warriors and a cleric. So that's a nice hall right there, though. It yes. is. Okay, I'm going to go to um, Waterdeep Harbor and I'm going to play an intrigue card. Score six points if each opponent has more corruptions than you. Nice. Oh, nice. Which, that's they why do. I wanted to return that earlier. Yeah. Yeah. Otherwise, I would not have intentionally given you two dollars. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So I get six points. Thank you. What do I need, bro? Do you guys need purple? Not really. You know what? Let's refresh the stack and see what happens. I do not want that. I do not want that. And I do not want that. So I'm gonna you don't want any. Yeah, I'm going to look at this one again. Whenever you assign an agent to the Plinith, you can take another and place them in your tavern. What is a Plinith? It's the space. Plint. Oh, found it. Okay, cool. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. So you can take an extra one plus Maybe corruption. Maybe I am taking that, so we'll do that. Oh, okay. It's another one that allows you to remove corruption from the game. Perfect. Okay, it's my turn. I'm going to go to the Grinning Line Tavern and take two rogues. And I'm going to complete a quest for white, orange, black, and two dollars. I get four points. And I get to put one building from Builder's Hall into play under my control at no cost. So I think I will take this building oh, here. Right. Wow. Nice. I am just more sure now about which lore you have. Buildings give you a ton of points. I don't know. I have no idea what Mackenzie's going for right now. Mm -hmm. What was the color? What and was another the building? What kind of quest did you just come? Piety is what I just picked up. Piety. Yeah. Okay. All right, it's my turn. I am gonna go to the right here. Yes. Slavers market. Slavers market. Get two. Uh, Orange. And one corruption. One corruption. Oh man, you have to give it to me. Yep. <laughs> Two black. Man. And I'm going to complete a quest. It's a piety quest. It requires two white and uh, one orange and two dollars. So I'm going to return a five and get uh, three. Mm -hmm. This is eight points. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And whenever I complete a piety quest, I score two. Oh, nice. And I have two right here. Yes, you do. I am going to take myself and go over here and get a quest of each color. You may get whatever token you want. Um, or quest. <laughs> oh, I should have gone there. Block of each color. And I will take a white cube. One of these. Um. So I actually can complete another quest if I want. So I'm going to do that. Going to spend a cleric as well as a rogue and spend two coins. So I'll give it back. Take three. And complete Give Honor to Mask. This one actually lets me, whenever you assign a token to the Plinith, you can take a, another cleric and a corruption and place them in your tab. Perfect. And how many points do you get? Um, I actually get eight. Eight. So you are blue. So you're 16 to 24. Mm hmm is it, so okay. that's the end of the round, except for now we go to Waterdeep Harbor. Yes. So mm -hmm. I think I want to play this card because, oh, maybe not. I don't think you can play any have... card anywhere on the board. Oh. You have to go to any remaining spaces, but you can't go back to Waterdeep Harbor because Waterdeep right. Harbor is I can technically draw, setting sail I can draw right entry now. cards. These cards are mean, too. I don't really want to play them. <laughs> Sure you don't. I don't. Sure I don't. don't. I am, I am being nice. I am being nice for this okay. game. So uh, I want to do this quest. I need white or purple. Where can I get white or purple? Right there. Purple. Right there or right there. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm, that's it. Mm -hmm. All right. I think I'm going to get a white. White. I actually have two mandatory quests that I can play on my opponents. But by keeping up with the piety theme, I'm going to go for the resources, which is more important to me anyway, instead of messing with my opponents. 
Okay, it's my turn. I mm -hmm. think I'm going to go to Aurora's Realm and get four dollars. Let's trade in a one. Because buildings cost money? Oh, I don't know. What are you going for? <laughs> you could be going for anything. You've completed... What did you complete? I am going for the... Piety quest. Yes, yes. You have two pi You have three piety quests. Okay, interesting. Yes. Interesting. We want to block right. Jackie. We have to go for piety quests. Mm -hmm. But there's no reason to block What did you me. complete? I don't know. Completed a piety quest? One piety and one something. Can you tell looking at this? She hat? didn't tell us. Yeah, she didn't tell us. Interesting. I, I, I showed it off. Everybody Interesting. saw it. Interesting. <laughs> All right. Um, it is my turn. I need purple. So I am going to go. I'm going to go right here. I'm going to take one corruption. Would you want to go there? I did. I'm going to take one of each. Uh, Allison, you get anything, one of your choice. And I do get cube. a corruption. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to complete a quest. This is uh, takes one purple, one orange, one black, and two white. So um, this is a piety quest, so I will score two points. One, two. It does not have any points reward, but at the start of each round, I can take any um, resource from the supply and place it in my tavern. Nice. Yep. So that's in itself its own reward. Nice. My turn. Let's see. Um, I believe I'm even going to have to go for more corruption and just get as much as I can. Okay, I'll take $2. Yeah. But for doing that, I also would like to take an entry card and take my corruption and complete a quest. So for money, for gold. Sleeping two ahead. warriors, two blacks, one purple, one white. And that will be my payment for this quest. Get two more entry cards and 18 points. Wow. 18 okay, points, so 18 please. plus 24 will be 42. Two. Wow, jumping ahead. Jumping ahead, for right. sure. Okay, I'm going to go to Waterdeep Harbor. I'm going to play an entry card. Call for adventures. I get to take two cubes of my choice from the supply, and everyone else gets to take one cube of their oh, choice. Oh, nice. Mm. Thank you. That's how you play an entry card. OK, so it's my turn. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm going to play this entry card. This allows me to, um, oh, she doesn't have money. Mm -mm. You know what? I'm going to be nice to you. I think I know what she's trying to do. Mm -hmm. So I'm actually going to choose you. I won't take two dollars from you, but I'm gonna take a look at your Lord's card. You're gonna look at my Lord? Yes. Oh my Lord. I am curious, oh, but <laughs> but you don't lose two dollars. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, oh, that explains everything. Okay. There you go. Okay. That was Jackie's turn. Okay. So he my turn. has five corruption. Corruption's currently worth negative three. I am first going to go down here to Waterdeep Harbor, and I also am going to play the entry card. I think I'm going to draw a quest from the deck equal to the number of players, and then keep one past the rest, and everybody gets to choose their own. Perfect. So it's a great, helpful entry card. We have been so nice to each What'd other. What'd you get? So far. Oh. oh. That one's very good. It's not you're bad. Close to, you're close to completing that. I'm already close to completing this. I guess I'm going to have to. I'm going to have to. The recruit, recruit the lieutenant. Mm. Oh, wow. She you got that take one. this skullduggery quest. I guess I'll take this one that nobody else wants. I will go to Blackstaff Tower. Mm -hmm. Take a purple cube and complete this Arcana quest for... One white, one orange, two purple, two black, and two dollars. I get 20 points, so I'm at seven, so we go to 27, and I get an entry card. All right. Um, hmm. I don't like these quests, so I'm going to reset it. All right, sounds like a plan. Okay, so. We have this one, which I don't really care about. Wow, this one. 
This one's really good for Allison. So should you just take it to block her? But it doesn't help me. It's a, it's a the quest where in, whenever you assign an agent to a building you control, you also gain the owner's benefit. You might as well take it so she can't have it. But you know I'm going for piety. Oh, I do know that so. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's pretty obvious. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I be so nice in this game, because I'm being what's pious. the word? Pious? Yes. Pious. I am. Red is pious, which is kind of oxymoron, so. You know what? Uh, you're going after me, right? So maybe you can block her because you have a chance. I, oh, I don't no. think I'm going to go for that, though. I'm just telling you the truth. I don't think I'm going to go pick up a quest right now. Well, you're out of agents. I know, but I need an agent. I got one more agent. Hmm. Well, then, don't put it on me what you won't do. All right. Uh, I'm going to take this piety quest, and I will reveal this card. So it seems they figured out which lord I am, but they're not blocking me, so hopefully I can get all of my buildings built. Okay, my turn. I think I will go ahead and take the Slaver's Market. Oh, darn. It's on you. On me, so Waterdeep Harbor sets sail. So let's see. I think I'm going to go to my own building, return a corruption, and take a dollar. <sighs> all right. Um, okay. All right. Uh, I guess I will just get white. Okay, Allison. I want you to lie to me right now. Are you the builder? I can't tell you until the end of the game. I Kenzie. totally think you're the builder. She, I can't tell you until the I end know, of the game. She's the builder for sure. She's got. Did me. I build the oh, last did round? You block by one? I didn't build you the build, last round. You build every round. You, but I could have built this round, and I didn't build this round. It's because you needed money. I had the money. All those now buildings are four points each. Nope, That's I've why had you it went for, over there. I've had it for many, many turns. I'm going to take a white, and I'm going to take a black. And I'm going to take an intrigue card. Did you get your corruption? I did get my corruption. And I am going to get the lieutenant. Oh, all right. right. So one of these Should guys is yours. Four or five. And you can play him immediately. You can go get that quest from her. I could. Yes. Thinking about it. It's Seeing if there's a better move for me. Seeing if there's a better move for me first. Okay. I mean, this quest is just too good for the builder. So, she has three buildings. I know. <laughs> I guess it's worth the most points on the board, too. Right, right. Unless this one. No. You don't have money. I don't have money. Wouldn't have any, I don't have anything for the get, building one either. Get entry cards. So I will stack up on these entry cards. Interesting. Interesting. That okay. made me feel good just because you can't have it. <laughs> okay, great. <It's> fantastic. <laughs> We're halfway through the game already. We are. Okay. My turn. I'm going to go to the slaver's market. And take two orange, two black. I'm going to complete a quest. Oh no, I can't complete a quest. What do I want to do? Hmm. That's all I'll do except for I'll take the corruption too. Okay. I'm going to come to this space mm -hmm. and I'm going to take this piety quest. Uh, of course. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I am going to complete a quest. Actually, can I get uh, one entry card? One entry card? Yes. You may. Thank you. So I can actually complete this quest, which uses two purple, two black, and one uh, orange. I get oh, seven no. points, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and two more entry cards, and four dollars. Mackenzie, can you draw me two more entry cards? I can. Thank you. Yep. Okay. My turn. Your um, turn. I'm going to... Yellow, you are a worry. <laughs> so, as a worry, I'm going to have to give you a mandatory oh, quest. Oh, come on now. I'm, I'm so far behind you. Oh, you're, you're me so a far behind quest. me. I'm what, 15? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's my key. Okay. I will go here and repay the favor. Each opponent with more corruption than you takes corruption from the corruption track and puts it in their tavern. I don't and grab an entry card. I don't think I don't think she minds. <laughs> yeah? No, I don't think she minds. She has three 
Six, How many eight negative corruption. points on the top right there? She has 32. Right, I've got a lot. We'll just, we'll negative, just say I've got a lot. Negative 32 right now, and I have negative 8, and you have negative 8. Is it my turn? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. I need a lot of white and a lot of orange. I'm going to go to Water Deep Harbor. Mm -hmm. I'm going to play this Intrigue card. I'm going to take a uh, four orange resource from the supply and one corruption. And you guys can, can take two orange and one corruption, if you would like. I'll, I'll take free money. And by free money, I mean free people, but I will pass. Hard pass on that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Mackenzie, you still have three people? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's her turn, I and she had the, the lieutenant. You know, I'm tired of these low quests. Somebody give me something worth something. I need some meaty 20s out here. A lot of quests getting reset. Yeah. Oh, shoot. One. We just lost your space. Two. Where were you? Yeah. Three. Yeah. Four. I got an eight. I got a 13. I got a 20. And I've got a 10. Definitely going to take this 20. And we'll, we'll worry about that corruption later. <laughs> you know, it's, it's, it's one of those things. You're just corrupt. Everybody's corrupt. Might as well be the most corrupt if you ha can. We're not that corrupt. Yeah! Well, <laughs> any corruption, a little corruption, especially if you're going for piety. <laughs> right, you got me there. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to go to Blackstaff Tower, take a purple, and complete this silly little mandatory quest that I was given. <laughs> for one, two, three. This goes in the Intrigue discard, and I will take two points. I... I'm gonna try not to take corruption, so I'm actually just gonna go here and get a white, and I'm gonna complete a quest, so I'm going to perform the penance of duty. I'm gonna spend two white, two orange, and uh, $4 to complete this quest. It gives me 12 po uh, points, but because it's piety, I get two more points, so one, two, three, four, 27, so 37, and it gives me a white and orange back. Nice. So I still have two agents left because I still had the extra agent. And I am going to get a little corruption. So with a little bit of everything else. Do one, you think you two, know what lore she has? Three, four. I mean, she's going really heavy on the corruption. She hasn't really been trying to return it. I mean, with another corruption, I also get an intrigue. She hasn't been taking any of the quests that return corruption, so and she might be. What is it? It's the Xanathar? Yep. So I got a lot of corruption, and uh, <laughs> it's worth it, though. Um, is it? Mostly, I guess. I guess I'm going to have to start returning some. Um, but th that's for another day. Are you? Yeah. That, yeah, oh, I'm gonna I'll go for it. Three bucks. As Even much as I can get. As building much buildings as I can get. really pays off. Yeah, for you. Mm -hmm. The builder. <laughs> <laughs> piety. Great. Oh, two pieties. Three pieties. All the piety Three quests pieties. are here. Oh, the girl's so low. Something knows I want to be a corrupt person because there's all these piety quests coming. Maybe I should switch to piety, but it's way too late in the game now. I'm in last place. <laughs> well, you're sitting on a lot of points right now. I'm, I'm sure of it. <laughs>